Law of the Bedroom number 105. Encourage even more communication from your gal in the bedroom. Again, encourage her to tell you what she wants. Ask her. Encourage her to be naughty. Live out her fantasies on you. Stroke her ego. She loves to be told how beautiful she is, how loving she is, how wet she is, and how well she's performing on you. You don't want her to stop during the middle of doing something wonderful to you, like facial plumbing and, you know, just to say, how am I doing? <laughs> no, uh, keep her going. Talk to her while she loves you and she's performing on you in special ways. Yes, you know, her mouth is busy, but her ears are wide open to listen. Yeah, um, you know, but what's more, your gal must be made to feel completely safe, comfortable, and desirable in your arms and in your heart every night. Some women feel inhibited because they fear their bodies aren't presentable or their sacred circles of love, moist, pink love, might taste or smell unpleasant to her man. She may be concerned that her love stallion is getting tired or bored or will stop just before she reaches her own orgasm. A new, 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 new. Let her know you are with her every step and lick of the way, <laughs> and that you are dedicated to her pleasure and her comfort throughout your entire time making love together. That's Law of the Bedroom number 105. Encourage even more communication from your gal in the bedroom. Hey, honey, how are we doing? How are you doing? Talk to me. What's on your mind? Uh-huh. Tell me more. I really want to know everything. Yeah, that's great. Mm, here, we're cuddling up here. Okay, and? And? Tell me more. All right, well, that's good enough. All right, well, I'm really glad you shared with me what was on your mind. I feel good. You feel good. How does that make you feel? Oh, it, feel, it makes me feel great. You know. Okay, guys, guys. Communication. Talking. In between, during, after, making love. It's the best. Women really love that. 